Hello, I'm Jill Bond from Wild About Wool and I'm here at the watershed in Slathwaite. I'm part of a team coordinating the Big Knit for the Woven Festival next year. We were all really inspired by the wonderful yarn bomb installations that happened in the 2019 festival for the Big Knit event. And there were all sorts spread in communities around Kirklees. So we want to build on that for the 2021 festival and make a yarn bomb installation that really puts us on the map. We held a public poll to get us started to decide what landmark we should yarn bomb. And this was the result. After a public poll, you voted for Huddersfield Railway Station as your landmark of choice to cover in lots of yarn bombing for the Woven Festival 2021. So we've been planning and designing some lovely knitted ideas for you to make this most wonderful installation using the pillars on the facade of the station. Let's take a look. Our aim is to make a yarn installation that is a rainbow of colour across the six pillars at the front of the station. And then we have plans to add in some patterned panels, maybe around the base of the columns, and some picture motifs that you have to search out as you look up the columns. So there you have it, the Big Knit Challenge for the Woven Festival 2021. And as you heard on the little outside broadcast there, we have taken inspiration from all the wonderful rainbows that were on display during lockdown for our rainbow mosaic. And that will be made up of yarny squares and rectangles that will be uh, fabricated together and hung from the top of the columns of the station uh, in a, a mosaic. And you can see from the graphic there what our ideas are of blending all these colours together to create this rainbow installation. Uh, we've got lots of ideas as well for uh, panels and motifs to augment the rainbow design across the top. The squares can be made out of any yarny discipline, so not just knitting. You can crochet, you can weave, you can use peg looms and pin looms to create your squares, or even your fingers. You could make squares out of old jumpers that you can shrink or even some rainbow coloured charity shop finds and make yarny collages out of them. There's all sorts of ways to get involved. But the most important thing is that you do. You sign up. Um, we can keep you in, informed then about um, all the different ideas, the patterns, the tutorial videos that we've got coming uh, online. Um, we're keen to sign up schools 
and groups, crafty groups, art groups, uh, after school clubs, uh, organisations, and we'll support you in getting involved. So there's another video more specifically about the squares, the colours, and what to do with them when you've uh, made them coming up as well. So please sign up and come on everybody, let's take up the Rainbow Knit Challenge.